greetings, everyone. I am Richard Davidson, and I am a neuroscientist by training, and a professor of psychology and psychiatry at the University of Wisconsin Madison. There are many challenges today that、uh, we confront all over the globe that. Uh, impacts our well-being. There is、uh, increased distractibility, increased reports of loneliness, increases in depression, and then there is a, a lack of、uh, meaning and purpose impacting people's motivation for engaging in work and many other activities. In our center, we have developed a framework for understanding. The plasticity of well-being. These four pillars include the following: the first we call awareness, which is where mindfulness would be, and that includes、uh, not only mindfulness but our capacity to regulate our attention. The second key pillar of well-being is connection, qualities that are important for healthy social relationships. Qualities like appreciation and kindness and gratitude. The third pillar we call insight. An insight is about getting curious about how our minds are actually working, particularly in relation to the narrative that we all carry around about ourselves. And finally, the last pillar of well-being is purpose, and purpose is about how we can find meaning and value in the things that we are doing. Well-being、uh, is a quality that we think of as a skill, and the more we practice, the research shows、uh, the better we get. And so, I would very much encourage viewers to join on this really important journey because there is no journey that is more important than our own flourishing as individuals and as. Uh, a species.